All right, from yoga to Pilates, there's no right or wrong way to get in shape. But when it comes to gym etiquette, there are a few do's and don'ts that everyone should follow. Sue Ann Brown from It's All About Etiquette is here with tips. I love this because a lot of people do you see a lot of faux pas at the gym uh, yes and I work out a lot and I couldn't wait to get to this segment with you because I just there's so many people that just don't know how to be respectful to everybody so, and this so. is a good point because a lot of people are getting ready to start going to the gym so you have kind of a top 10 yes. tips on gym etiquette right exactly so I basically the first one be, would be to wipe down your equipment after you're done using it and you usually most gyms will give you towels and so forth or provide with the sanitizing wipes um, you want to always make sure that you return the, the equipment back to where you found it because other people want to use it and it's spread all over the gym yeah you don't want to uh, just leave it there no so okay, you know when we go back to the first as, as mm. far as wiping down the gym equipment why is that so important well because because you know flu season's coming up and you don't want to be catching that and it's just kind of icky anyways you know so it's always nice to wipe everything down yeah, for and somebody they usually else do. so keep an mm -hmm. eye on that exactly okay. um what's next as far I, as this i would say that um be on time i do a lot of classes at the gym and be on time because if you go late everybody else has to shuffle around in the class to accommodate your space so be on time for all your classes and don't mon not monopolize the equipment so um you know if you're on the treadmill or whatever do your time and then go and then go off then get I, off I like your point about being on time because I do um, hot yoga oh. so I'll get my space and then I'm so happy because the class is getting ready to start and then they'll let someone else come in and they'll put their mat like really in my space yes and I'm like oh I know it that but I don't have time to do. move I know I know so I know. it drives me crazy I know that's why I have that on there because it drives what, me nuts what else drives you nuts like uh, what is your biggest thing uh phones cell phones uh, right, and right that's why I've got it here because because I just if if you just give the time to yourself if it's an hour working out or whatever don't get c connected to your phone so don't talk on your phone no that's your biggest thing. exactly and okay. and give your time that it's an hour of your time just de-stress leave the phone because you don't want to hear other people's conversation yeah okay. exactly and mm -hmm. you also said you know what in the locker room you can be a little modest yes and that's exactly. why you have this towel here yes and you know you want to always cover up a little bit and give people space so if there's locker space don't go right next to the person and change and dress next to that person it kind of yeah. makes them feel a little, a little uncomfortable space. and yeah. you were saying if you're you know comfortable walking around naked good for you that's yes. awesome but maybe people aren't comfortable they watching a lot of them aren't around. so yeah so cover <laughs> so up absolutely absolutely you actually teach classes to adults and kids tell me about that. yes I've got a class coming up for my six to eight year olds coming up in February they're four weeks classes and I also do adults and uh, corporations as well yeah and so. you kind of run the gamut on gym etiquette to talking to your you know kids about how to act at a restaurant yes, and on and on absolutely so they're great classes to social skills that's you know it it's really all it, it's what very good it's good, all about etiquette good tips. <laughs> it's all about etiquette that is the name for more information all you have to do is go online visit it's all about or call the number on your screen